everyone welcome to simply grace lifestyle so i have a haul uh, from walmart so let's get started some more but I just grabbed one I try to be good so every time I buy one of these it's always a different bag this is the ruffle potato chips the great value brand I like it so it doesn't taste any different than a regular ruffle bag and I just need a few when I'm eating a uh, hamburger or something like that I'm just gonna put stuff away guys because I don't want to clutter up my the counter as I'm showing you. Okay, so I usually get the um, vitamin D and K uh, in one, but they didn't have any, so I got the K2 uh, by itself because I already have the uh, vitamin D in the drawer. So I just got the K2. This one, the K2, helps to work both of them together. It helps absorb the vitamin D and send it where it needs to go. <laughs> so we got one of these. I don't know if that made any sense, guys, but those two, the vitamin D and K work together. All right, so the Great Value brand, Fig, Fig Bars. I love Fig Newtons, and now they have them in strawberry, but I was gonna grab it in strawberry, but I just grabbed the regular one. So we got one of those. I don't understand what's up there. Um, what is that? Okay. All right, so we've got the blue. All right, the blue. Uh, the fig is up on there. Okay, so now we have the um, oatmeal cookies. We need some cookies. So I got some of those. got two of the Propel, uh, and this is just the electrolytes that we pour in the water, the, the water, the envelopes, and Matthew seems to like more the orange raspberry, so I got to give that a try. It sounds delicious, doesn't it? And I think I have the grape flavor in here, and maybe, oh no, and black cherry, so we're going to give, well, I think he already tried these and finished the boxes, so we got two more. Then I got two of the chili but with the beans i was buying the chili without the beans and it tastes so much better with the beans and they don't upset my stomach or anything so i only grabbed two cans and uh, we may have one tonight with our with our hot dogs because today is today we're just having hot dogs so let's see i can't reach up there Get something to step on to get up there to fix that okay so then we got some dill pickles because I got the sweet the other day and he doesn't like the sweet I do but I don't need it so we're going to get the dill so we got one of these then for some reason I I wanted to try the spam so I just got a regular can of the spam I'll probably be recording this when I cook with it so we're gonna try, try to make something with it. I needed a bag of potatoes. Okay, and these are the russet. Just got a small bag. So grab one of these. I think I still have two potatoes left over there. All right, so I have a bag of onions because we use onions in everything. Okay, so let's 
move this one on over because and this is the I got some freezer stuff in one of those other bags too but I know my eggs are in here so I want to get them out I love this bag I don't know if you guys have one of these bags they're so good alright so I did get some broccoli too that's I throw this in pretty much everything that I'm cooking on the stove. We're so really getting some vegetables in and Matthew seems to like them. So I got two of these. Let me just grab the other freezer stuff. So, no, three. I got three of the broccoli florets. All right, so I love blueberries. So you guys have been watching my home, you know that I love the blueberries. So I think this time around, not sure how many bags I got. So for right now, let me put these away. I say every time I buy the blueberries, I can eat one bag of those a day. And really, I can eat more, but I just, I just stick to the one bag a day. Uh, that's how much I love blueberries. So I, I didn't even want to bother to cook when we got in the door. I told Matthew, I'm just going to buy a bag of the French fries and throw them in the air fryer while I'm cooking the hot dogs because I am hungry right now. So I'm going to go ahead and put that there. Very rarely you hear me saying that. And all of you who know me know I like the bacon. <laughs> I absolutely love bacon. I could eat this every single day. So that's going in the freezer. And I know why, because the eggs are not in this bag. I thought they were. So we got two of, I got two of the hamburgers, okay? And these were like $12.97. That's not bad. These come, a lot of burgers come in here. And so I just decided to go ahead and get two because either Matthew eats them here, I eat one, he'll eat two, and then whatever he takes, if he does take it to work, usually we'll just eat it at home. This stuff lasts a long time for us. I did get some hot dogs, so we got the Oscar Mayer, so we're gonna be making this. We have some chili and some fries over there. Wow. I love that bag. Somebody gave that to me and I don't know who. Okay, so we got the chicken cutlet. So we kind of stick with chicken cutlet, but we have been eating more of the uh, burgers, so the beef, and I don't know, I can just do so much more with the chicken cutlets. So I gotta start thinking up more recipes uh, to make this. from but anyway I wound up with this bag and I don't even remember buying it so somebody probably gave it to us. Let me just take out all the bread. So these are two of the ballpark hamburger buns and then I got one of the ballpark hot dogs so that's going to go over there and you know we can't go to the store <laughs> and she's sitting there staring at me. Nala, because she absolutely loves her uh, her bread. So I just got three. She only gets little small pieces. So let me go ahead and put this in the freezer. I do have the receipt in my pocket 
the bill was about 150. It's 149 and change for everything that I'm showing you here because I know you guys have been showing the amounts of everything. So this whole grocery haul for us today was 149 plus. So I'm just gonna round it up to 150 and that's what I paid today. Uh, okay, so this is a solid white tuna, but it is the Great Value brand and there's nothing wrong with their brand um, at all. It's the solid white tuna and that's the only tuna I would eat and I was very surprised I like this tuna. But then I also got him, well when I get to it, but I have to wait till I get to it. So he likes the sharp cheddar cheese, so I get him that. And then we were running out of honey, and this is the one he uses. Well, it's either the Winnie the Pooh or whatever. I just like the, the uh, container, isn't that cute? So I grab one of those. And then I usually get the honey trees sugar-free. So the, this is the honey that I get, and it tastes so delicious. It is sugar-free. You're probably wondering how you can buy sugar-free honey, but that's the one I'm using. And um, I, I really got to get to reading the ingredients in the back. But I get the sugar-free, and he gets this one. Now... Here's the other bag of the blueberries. I thought, yeah, I did get more. Okay. All right, so I got him. All right, so the first time I made him this, he didn't seem to be too happy with it, Matthew. So it was the Chunk Chicken Breast, the Great Value brand. And then I just shredded it up like, you know, like you would if you were having tuna fish. I didn't leave it uh, in chunks. And then he liked it better. So that was it. So I got three of the tuna fish, which he's the one who mostly eats it, and then three of the chicken. So he likes that variety, he can taste the difference. Then we did get two of the yogurt. Now they did not have the vanilla, the Greek vanilla. Uh, I like the, I don't like light. So this is the light Greek. I like the regular Greek yogurt vanilla flavor. But I grabbed this one today because it's just quick to grab for and I don't normally get this. This is the light, but we got two of these in vanilla. And then I got another two containers of the uh, low fat cottage cheese, small curd, 1% milk, 1% milk, uh, milk fat. Two of these containers absolutely love cottage cheese. And we eat it for the protein, both of these for the protein. And then we just add, I add either blueberries or I'm adding honey and it tastes so good. Okay, so I have done with that one. Now this is the last bag, guys. So let me just bring you a little bit closer. I probably should put this away. So let me just go ahead and do that because these things take up a lot of room. Now the hamburger buns, I think I'm gonna go ahead and put these in the freezer. everything off I do have to put that cheese in the fridge so so now we're kind of stocked up on the tuna I just have to go out to Sam's Club a different store for the dog food and then that, that has to go in the refrigerator along with these eggs anyway so here's another bag of the blueberries I'm so excited I'm gonna put this in the sink so you can thaw maybe I can have that later and then I got three dozen of the cage free eggs. We've been eating eggs quickly. It usually takes us a while, but I've been making a lot of stuff with eggs. 
So I got three of the dozens, okay, of the dozen eggs. And so that's gonna go in the refrigerator with that cheese. So, all right guys, so that is the end of the haul. I hope that you enjoyed the video as much as I enjoyed showing you. If you liked the video, click like, share, and comment. Don't forget to subscribe guys. And don't forget to hit that notification bell so that you can get notified each and every time I upload a video. Have an amazing day and I'll see you in the next one. God bless you.